MCTV is on the air. Imagining you, I do. I think about you day and night. It's only right to think about the girl you love and hold her tight. So happy together. If I should call you up, invest a dime. And you say you belong to me Is my mind Imagine how the world could be Standing by live in our Mifflin County Television Studios Here's your MCTV anchor team Good morning Huskies Welcome back from the three day weekend Weather-wise, today expect mostly sunny skies with a high of 37 degrees. And Mrs. Baker is our teacher, DJ of the day. It's Monday, February 28th, and day one of the 6 day cycle. Please rise for our national anthem and the pledge to the flag. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Seniors, new local scholarship applications have been posted in the guidance office on the scholarship board. If you're planning to pursue any further schooling after high school, please stop by to see if you qualify for any of these local scholarships. Concert choir lessons today are Period 1, Danny Garner, Gabe Kolpetzer, Period 2, Clayton Maxwell, Period 4, Gina Zanino, Period 6, Draven Moy. Don't forget the Stall Day is coming. Stall Day is where students and faculty bring in loose chains to their first period classes. Containers for every teacher that has a first period and willing to participate were delivered this morning and collections will run from now through Friday. Anyone during your first period can bring in loose chains to put it in the container. Next Monday, March 7th, which is the actual stall day, first period teachers are not supposed to start class until they have completely counted the money raised from their class. This would stall the start of a Monday morning, allowing kids a little free time at the start of the day. The class that raises the highest amount will win donuts. Also, many thought members. We will be having a makeup meeting tomorrow morning at 740 in the auditorium. Positive Vibes is holding a button design contest. Your original design should reflect the club's mission to spread kindness and positivity. Not only will the winning design be used for this year's button, but the artist behind it will receive a $25 Sheets gift card, a Be Kind shirt, and a custom beanie. Email your designs to Mrs. Pasco or DM them to Positive Vibes Instagram page by this Friday for a chance to win. Attention students! This Friday, a 5-on-5 five -five March Madness basketball tournament will hit MCHS. Team registration forms are available from your English teachers. Participating teams will collect sponsored donations for Minithon that will be recorded and turned in with the registration forms. All registration forms for the tournament this Friday are due to Mrs. Baker in the room in room B301 by the end of the day today. Attention all juniors and seniors. Prom will be held on April 23rd at Brookmere Estates from 7 to 10:30 p.m. There will be food trucks, a coffee bar, desserts and other refreshments as well as yard games and fire pits. If you want to join us for a Una Bella Note, an Italian-themed beautiful night, tickets are on sale now through March 11th at all lunches. Tickets are $30 per person. For students that do not eat lunch at MCHS, you can come to A316 or A320 to purchase tickets before or after school. Class dues must be paid before you can purchase a ticket. These are $10. Guest forms, which can be located 
which can be picked up at lunches, must be submitted for guests outside of MCHS, including those that have graduated. Any questions, please see Mrs. Hecknauer or Mrs. Pascoe. We will have representatives from South Hills here this Thursday at 10 a.m. to talk with interested students about admissions and academic programs. Students must sign up ahead of time to attend the meeting. Sign up on the Guidance Google Classroom or in the Guidance Office to obtain a green pass for the day of the visit. CJ is up next with sports, but first, here's Nathaniel from the Academy with a special announcement. Good morning. I'm Nathaniel McKnight, a, stu a student in the Mechatronics Department at the Academy. If you're a student planning a career, come and see what's being offered at the Mifflin County Academy of Science and Technology. The Academy is hosting an open house next Tuesday, March 1st, from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. There will be student demonstrations, hands-on activities, sample from the Culinary Bake Shop, and more. There are about the programs for uh, secondary and adult education from anything ranging from automotive repair to cosmetology as well as welding. Our growing adult education courses at the Academy include practical nursing, cosmetology, EMT, CDL training, and AWS certified welding program. So make plans to attend the open house next Tuesday, March 1st from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. at the Academy of Science and Technology. We're located at 700 Pitt Street in Lewistown Heights. Now here's CJ with sports. Over the weekend in MC Sports, it was a successful weekend for MC Matt Men at the District 6 Individual Tournament in Altoona. Four of our wrestlers were crowned individual champions, including Nick Allison, Kyler Everly, Jackson Popo, and Trey Shoemaker. Our team was also crowned District Individual Champs as well, with 11 of our wrestlers advancing on to regionals this coming weekend. Great job, guys. Today in MC Sports, our girls' basketball team's playoff game tips off at Mount Aloysius. Our Lady Huskies will face State College for the district finals. If you can't make it to tonight's game, Isaac Halleck and myself will be live tonight on MCTV with all the action. The team is excused today at 1.45 p.m. Good luck, girls. Unfortunately, there was not enough student interest in a fan bus for the game at Mount Aloysius this evening, so the fan bus has been canceled. Again, the fan bus to tonight's game has been canceled. Girls lacrosse open gyms this week are Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday from 3.30 to 5 in the junior high gym. It is the last week for beginners to, beginners to get a head start and old kids to refresh their skills. Also, have you re registered for, spring, for the spring season yet? The deadline is March 2nd. That's a quick look at sports. Maddie, what's for lunch? In the Husky line, barbecue chicken with roll, potato chips, baked beans, assorted fruit, and milk. And in the griller, hamburger or breaded chicken sandwich. We have one final announcement. Attention juniors, are you looking for a junior position next school year during your senior year? Geisinger Lewistown Hospital has openings and is interviewing for positions in the dietary and house housekeeping departments if you are looking for a career position next school year. These positions would be for next year's schedule and you would receive academic credit beginning in the fall. Information for these various positions are available through the co-op slash career pathways office in room B202. See, please see Mr. Fluke for the websites for the Geisinger Employment Portal. Thank you. That's it for the morning show. For the entire MCTV production team, she's Maddie, I'm Simon. Enjoy the day. Have a husky day.